हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ चैप्टर थ्री सब्ट्रैक्शन हियर आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू प्रैक्टिस क्वेश्चंस व्हिच आर गोइंग टू कम इन योर एग्जाम ओके चिल्ड्रन एज पर द न्यू सिलेबस यू आर सपोज टू डू द सब्ट्रैक्शन ऑफ ओनली टू डिजिट नंबर थ्री डिजिट नंबर एंड फोर डिजिट नंबर सब्ट्रैक्शन इज नॉट इन योर सिलेबस सो आई एम गोइंग टू गिव प्रैक्टिस क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द सिलेबस Here, first one we are going to do fill-ups. Okay, A part seventy-five minus one. See, children, these fill-ups are based on the properties which we did in the last video. Seventy-five minus one. When one is subtracted from a number, the answer is always the predecessor. The predecessor of seventy-five will be seventy-four. Now B part thirty-four minus. Dash is equal to thirty three means what could be subtracted from thirty four to get thirty three? See, this is again a predecessor. So what we can subtract from thirty four? We can subtract one from thirty four to get thirty three. Eighty eight minus eighty eight. Same numbers are being subtracted, so answer will be zero. Now forty two minus dash is equal to forty two. What can be subtracted from this number to get the same number? What we can we subtract? We can subtract zero. Now sixty two minus what is equal to sixty one? This also one. Fifty three minus two. See, the children, this question is little different here. We are have not done any property regarding this, but we have to estimate this. See, children, here it is a two digit number and here it is a single digit number. So we have to subtract ones place and ones place. Ones place here it is three and here it is two. So we have to directly subtract three and two. Okay, we are not supposed to do anything with this ten 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 digit number. Three minus two, one, and the digit at tens place will remain as it is fifty one. Thirty six minus zero something. When uh, we subtract zero from something, the answer will always be the number itself. Thirty six. So here are some uh, homework. Questions for you: A part eighty six minus eighty six is equal to dash. B part thirty three minus dash is equal to thirty two. Nine minus dash is equal to nine. Thirty six minus two is equal to dash. Sixty two minus one is equal to dash. Now, next questions which we are going to do are subtraction of two digit number without regrouping. Without regrouping means without borrowing. Okay. Now here. I am going to do two questions for you, and two questions you have to do yourself. See, children, first one, ones, tens, you have to write as we had done earlier also. Then leave one box here. Ninety-four minus forty-two. Four minus two, two. Nine minus four. Do you remember this? See. See, children, in the last videos which we did of chapter uh, subtraction, chapter three. We had gone from five to nine. Suppose the number four is given here. We have to start from the next number. If it is four here, we'll start from five. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. What is answer? One, two, three, four, five. So nine minus four is five. Now B part. Four minus zero. Some when we subtract zero from something, we'll get the same number four seven minus three. So we here it is three. So we have to start from four and we have to go till seven. Four five six seven. Answer is one two three four. So seven minus three. Answer will be four. Now C and D part you have to do yourself. C part is eighty nine minus sixty four, and D part is sixty three. Minus twenty one. Here we are going to start with the subtraction of two digit numbers with regrouping. With regrouping means when we have to borrow. See the first question here: ninety two minus thirty six. See children, first we have to see the ones column. Here in the ones column, we have two and six. We are not, uh, we are not uh, able to subtract. Six from two, so it has to borrow from this nine. When this nine will give two two, it will become eight, and this two will become twelve. 
Now 12 minus 6 we can subtract. See 6 here. So we have to start from 7. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So answer is 6. Now 8 minus 3. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 minus 3, 5. Now B part. Here it is 0 and 7. Not possible. So it will borrow from 4. This will become 3 and 0 will become 10. Now 7 here. So we will start with 8. 8, 9, 10. 3. Now 3 minus 1. 2. C and D part you have to do yourself. 92 minus 63. And D part 74 minus 26. So children whenever you practice for the subtraction sums. Take only two digit numbers. And do it with the grouping and regrouping. Okay children practice hard.